Hello, uh, this is Marco here and I'm going to demonstrate about this pannable viewport and how it can be used for panning any Q graphics widget based widgets. So in this first example I have two pannable viewports here and as you can see it clips uh, the widget that it contains so that uh, uh, if you define the pannable viewport as smaller than the widget that it pans then it clips everything that goes around it borders and here's another pannable viewport uh, which have, have this, has this multiple directions enabled at the same time so runs pretty smoothly on iMac at least so the next next example is uh, uh, this pannable viewport on uh, Q graphics web view and you can pan it pretty fast also and you can drag it and then it takes you back to the corner and same goes like here so this is a Q graphics web view that is put inside this pannable view and then this last example shows that it's possible to do sort of a slideshow so you can see in the middle is always the item that this pannable view is made to move to and you can still drag it and but then it just goes to the item that is defined to be in the center so this is a one way to do a slideshow also and uh, this also runs on N900 but there seems to be uh, some kind of problem with this uh, OpenGL stuff because it, it flips all the graphics there so this is the same same uh, pannable widget with Q graphics web view in it and I can also show this demo here so I think it runs quite nicely but there's definitely something wrong with this uh, OpenGL stuff because as you can see all the pictures are upside down so and the slideshow example so you can see the green item there in the middle and you can also make it to pan by finger okay that's all the source code is available at Kidorius thanks for watching